Okay, we're going to be doing this two-player playthrough, which we've tried a bunch, but it keeps failing. So hopefully this will be the one we get to keep. Okay, so yeah, let's just get started here. Okay, so I'm player one, and um, Tyler is player two, but he's not talking right now for some reason. Alright. Hello, Slig. Doi! Okay. So, um, yeah, basically, um, this, uh, obviously is on the PlayStation Network, and, yeah, we're doing this two player game, and Tyler's player two. I don't know when or if he's going to start talking, but we're just doing a secret for now. You know, same old, same old. I do just um waiting. Okay, so yeah, for now I'm just going to talk. Tyler will talk eventually. It will. I think he will. I don't know. But whatever. Okay, and we're done with the secret. Alright, now let's get out of the factory and travel through the rest of the island. Yeah, oh yeah, in the directory. Well, if you're not, like, a completionist, then, or if you just don't care, then you don't have to do it, obviously. Yeah. Layout of Rupture Farms, numbers, legs, is like Weirin, and Madokin's in here. Oh, yeah, by the way, if you're like noise, um, okay, like, um, whenever, uh, I make videos and, uh, some of my family comes in, they all want to talk, um, so, oh. I see a slick near Mudokin. Hopefully, it's derpy. For those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, um, in one of our previously failed attempts at recording this, there was one um, slig who was actually kind of nice um, to the Armadokans, so we named it Derpy. But because my skin's blue, Derpy decided to go racist and... Um, <laughs> And, um, the secret, of course. What? What? And just possess the slugs. Or this one, of course, gets killed. And you can just possess the other. And yeah, just kill that one obviously because it will seek through your possession. Mm -hmm. And get another grenade to take out that anti possession orb. Ah. And just save these two Dawkins. The obvious point to Obrold Abe's Odyssey is to kill Moloch the Gluckin. Um, yeah, but... Actually, you know, there's only one, uh, Mudokin you actually need to save, and that's really late in the game, but we're going to try to save all 99. Or, no, we're not going to try to, we will. Because I've done it so, I've done it many times before. And, um... Well, I mean, Tyler, let's see how well he's able to do it. I know I can, but I don't know how well he is. And since we're not able to talk right now, um, it just... I don't know how we'll, I'll be able to help him out, though. But, um... Yeah, well, then again, too, like, it could depend, because... 
Um, at least as far as I know, he's we're not able to communicate by any way. I don't know, but I don't know. Who knows? Maybe like um, he knows like from why like, watching me on the screen. Like maybe, or maybe even like uh, he's like spying on me. Well, actually, it'd be kind of hard for me or for him to spy on me. Well, because um, well. I live in a two-story house. Okay. Yeah, and so if anything, um, I'd probably be spying. On him. <laughs> no, no, because he lives in a two-story house too. But I know his house. I know his house. Well, I mean, I know his house, but like he really knows mine, though. So he would have that. He really knows mine because I live in his old house. <laughs> okay, so. Yeah, my my house is bigger than our houses in the neighborhood. <laughs> uh, no, not really. Well, I mean, like I live in a decent house and all, but it's um, it's just you know, it's not like a masterpiece by any means. Let's go down here. But yeah, um, anyways, uh, with saving Dawkins, because. Um, if you save all 99, then you get the 100% ending, but you have to save, uh, well, there's only one Mudokin you're actually required to save, and it's pretty late in the game, but, um, you have to save at least 50 to get the good ending. So let's save this guy. And let's go. Hello, Mudokin. Okay. Yeah, and save these two guys. Wait, okay. Hello. Hello, Hello, Follow me. Okay. Wait, okay. Alright, so save them. And let's go on to the packaging. Where we have another Mudokin to save. Okay. And another. Woo. Wait. Okay. Hello. Hello. Follow me. Okay. Okay. And. So, um, wait. Why did. What? <sighs> okay. Now go. And, why is he not going in? What? Oh, okay. You know what? Okay. Now. Go. Okay, go in this time. Okay, there we go. Uh. Okay. There. Uh. Oh, crap. No. Oh. Oh, God. I, didn't, I don't know how I didn't kill me. I don't know how I got through that either. Uh, okay, so let's not do that. That was just stupid of me. Okay, let's try it again. Let's possess this slig. Okay, well that normally doesn't happen. Normally shoots me and we shoot each other at the same time, but whatever. Follow 
cage. Get him off. Oh, phone's ring. Okay, I don't have to answer it. Because someone else will. I know. Okay, and let's save these Mudokins. First, let's get the together the anti possession orb. Okay, there. Sometimes that can be hard to judge. Now, we scare away the birds, of course. So let's save them now. Oh, I got hit by it. Oh. Well, oh, how can I let that happen so early in the game? Oh, okay, well, now it's Tyler's turn. Player two. Alright. Well, he's looking good so far. Right. Okay. He's docking to be saved. Yep, okay, he got it. Right. Oh no, Derpy sees him. Oh, okay. Now it's my turn. And there, that checkpoint's right there. Completely enough. Both times, um, each one has died. Checkpoint's right there. All right, so let's do this. Well, there goes Derpy. Okay. 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 And yeah, just possess the slig. Don't shoot into the shadows, obviously, because there's a Madoc in there. You can shoot through these ones though, because there's no Madocans. Um and yeah, there's a door we'll be going into where we'll go to the shipping area and uh, escape from Rupture Farms. We'll be done with Rupture Farms for the first time, we'll come back. Yeah. And explore the rest of the island. Yeah, well, I think. Because we are um, on an island. Well, I think. Well, I think, like, actually, well. Actually, um. I think there, um, it's actually like there's supposed to. I think that, um, further inland it connects to the mainland. So, yeah, I think so. If you if it's further in. But we will travel through different worlds, though. So I mean, I see that. Okay, now this part seemed really amazing, because, you know, like, to me when I was a kid playing this game, because, you know, like, the game engine for this game is alive, which is aware life forms in a virtual environment, and, you know, it was, at the time, because how artificially intelligent these characters are, and, like, looking at the screen, you know, um, a platform like factory field area and just how the Mudokans are able to perform their own interactions with this and the characters are very independent and have their own um... have their own um... Uh, just own intelligence essentially it's artificial intelligence for characters and it's amazing how advanced they are at it so yeah this is really fun to watch. I mean now it probably doesn't seem like much but it's still it's it's great. It's it was revolutionary at the time.